Hello YouTube, welcome back to another video. Uh, today, as you can see, it is just it's just me and you guys. Uh, no stinky Twitch chat here. They're not joining me today. Uh, I know, right? Finally got rid of those bozos on Twitch. Those Twitch frogs. Oh my god. Yeah, we should we should let them know how we really feel, right? Go down in the comments below and let Twitch know how you truly feel about them because they're not here to defend themselves today. I'm kidding. They are they are actually right here. I, I just hit them, but today <laughs> in a celebration of 1 million subscribers. Yes, this is going to be the very first video I post, I think, from the time I have hit 1 million subscribers. And, you know, just getting it out of the way, I just want to say thank you. Thank you for subscribing. Thank you for supporting me. And thank you for, you know, helping me us as a community accomplish this absolutely insane milestone. So I just want to say thank you for that. And in honor of this milestone today, I wanted to take a look back into the past. I wanted to go through some Anthony Chen lore and discover, you know, just exactly how did this channel begin? What are the steps we took along the way and where we've ended up today? So I'm going to be going back and reacting to some of my very first YouTube videos. Now, don't you worry. Yes, guys, don't worry. This is not the 1 million subscriber special, I promised you guys. This is not gonna be the only thing, okay? <clears throat> Stick around to the end of the video if you wanna hear more about that, but don't worry, I haven't forgotten. It's coming, it's coming. All right, taking a look at my YouTube channel. 1 million subscribers, wow. Let's take a look. Let's take a look at these videos here. My very first video down here, you can see day in the life of a TikTok star. Let's see, shall we, about the origin of Anthony Chen. Oh man, just clicked into the video, not even two seconds in, uh, and I've already doxed my entire college. Bruh. That was a great decision to do, but... Uh, uh, it's pretty much public information at this point, but whatever. Now, before we actually, you know, jump into and react to the video, I just wanted to say, yes, this is my very first YouTube vi upload on this channel. I did actually make one video prior to this on a separate channel, and some of the Twitch viewers right here know because I have shown it on stream before, but this was not my very first video. This is uh, my second ever video I have posted onto YouTube. Will I show you the other video? <sighs> Let me see if I can find it. Oh man. <laughs> Oh man, this takes me back. This is actually the very first video I ever uploaded on April 27th of 2020. It has 500 views right now because I showed it on stream, but it is titled How to Really Play Valorant, a 13 minute video that I made during quarantine of 2020, the beginning of quarantine to be more specific. And this was the very first time I ever touched anything related to like video editing or recording. I downloaded some sort of free software, uh, recorded one of my Valorant matches, booted did it into like this bootleg Adobe Premiere and spent like 16 hours straight in one sitting just editing together this video. I'm not going to show you the entirety of it because I don't think that's really necessary for you to just just grasp the concept of just where my editing skills were at the time. OK, I will play maybe the intro for you. OK, here we go. Oh, my God, the lag. Okay, that's all you get. Um, in short, this is just a Valorant compilation. This was during the Valorant beta. My original plan for content creation was to uh, be a Valorant content creator. I actually wish I had stuck with it now that I think about it, but uh, here we are now, two years later, and still hard stuck Immortal 1 in Valorant. No, she has an op. She's gonna say. What? Good night. What? <laughs> okay, okay. <laughs> now ignoring the 30 FPS and choppy frames that it is recording at. Yep, that is, that was me. And my one and maybe only adventure into creating any sort of Valorant content. All right, anyways, back to the day in the life of a TikTok star. I 
As a college student, I am a pretty big believer of being well rested and ready to face the day. That's why every morning when I wake up, the very first thing I do is to go back to sleep. I still stand by this, by the way. <laughs> uh, I did want to point out. So the entire uh, entire point of this video was supposed to be like a college lifestyle vlogger parody. So if you couldn't tell, I am looking at supposedly a fake interviewer. That was the concept. It turns out not many people in the comments actually got that. And a lot of people thought I was just extremely shy to make eye contact with the camera, which is very not true, as you can see. But if you didn't know, yes, it's supposed to be a pair. It's supposed to be a parody. It's supposed to be a parody. In the cold and stuff, but yeah, I'm. I consider myself pretty lucky. <laughs> Did you guys see? I consider myself pretty Did you guys lucky. see? You guys see that? <laughs> you guys see that video cut right there? Oh my god. Let me let me let me explain what happened here. Okay. So basically, I edited and filmed this entire video on my phone and then transferred it over to this MacBook you see right here actually on the screen and edited it edit edit I edited it in iMovie. This MacBook was not the most revolutionary of technologies, especially iMovie, uh, I will say. And for the love of God, no matter how many times I exported this video, I could not get like the visual errors to go away. I still don't know what the issue was to this day, which is why I use Premiere Pro now. Uh, and honestly, if you're looking into higher levels of editing, I generally would not suggest iMovie, although it is a perfectly fine option. It's free as well, but. Oh, also I can't actually play this clip for you now because this music is copyrighted. Yep, that was like a big slap in the face. The very first video I ever uploaded, they slapped me with the copyright claim. We'll just skip here. Um, I actually get asked this one a lot. You know, with every good project, um, it always starts with an idea. So no comment on that. <laughs> you couldn't tell this era was inspired by none other than best dressed. And I'm even taking uh art class which i have turned in some magnificent works for and you know it really helps deepen my understanding of me and my creative <laughs> let me, sorry let me just tell you guys about this art class in specific this particular art class i was referencing was a drawing 100 course that i took my freshman year of college for the first like four weeks of class we were literally just drawing lines and like circles with charcoal now i know you're supposed to like master the basics and i guess this was assuming like no one had ever touched any form of artistic instrument in their lives but come on four weeks four weeks and then get this this is even better okay after those four weeks i guess the professor just didn't see any uh any shred any speck of talent within us and he just left like he just he just he just disappeared i still don't know what happened to him to this day but he just disappeared we didn't get any updates from him, like no emails and we were like okay what's going on so after like a few days uh like the class got together and we had to like email the dean of the section like yo um so like our professor hasn't said anything to us in about like two weeks it is is something going on with that or should we should we be worried and then they're like oh oh yeah wait we should definitely look into that and we did end up getting a, a new professor but that was just that was that was just my one and only experience with any type of drawing course in college what do i have any friends of course why do you ask lots lots of friends too many a lot too many to count is, wow, my my acting. <laughs> no, 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 no. Turn, turn that. <laughs> my acting has just wow, wow. My acting has not improved over the past two years. I can tell you that. So my nights usually end off with business responsibility. You know, stuff that people don't usually see, like you know, responding to uh, business inquiries or you know just. This was a real DM, by the way. My like and subscribe, and I hope you guys all have a good one. <laughs> and who let me choose this atrocious green background here? <laughs>
<laughs> Who let me do this? Oh my god. To my editors, thank you. You guys, you guys have saved me. Meeting, meeting you guys and have being able to work with you all is just a godsend. Now, if you wanted some context as to why I made that video, I would say the primary reason is because initially i wanted to be a college lifestyle vlogger yep i'm sure you guys have heard of elliot Choi. i mentioned best dressed ashley earlier in the video but those were uh, some vloggers that i took heavy inspiration from especially during that phase of my life and i wanted to be a college lifestyle youtuber who went around and vlogged their daily life as you can see by the content of my channel that didn't exactly work out but i would say for for my very first upload that was i would rate it like a solid seven or eight out of ten for something that i filmed on my iphone which explains the audio quality as well as like having literally close to no prior editing experience i think i did a pretty decent job that video idea if i could refilm that would be like a very banger video who knows maybe i will refilm it one day we'll call it a day in the life of uh what even am i now Day in the life of a really overworked and sleep deprived content creator who also happens to be a full time student. Yeah, let me know if you if uh, if you guys ever want to see that video be released on uh, the channel. That would that sounds like a very, very interesting concept, right? All right, let's move on to the next video. What should we look at next? That was my very, very first video. I guess I'll just skim over the next few ones briefly. Beefing with TikTokers in Among Us. This was from my very first stream. I, I guess it's I guess it's worth, you know, just clicking into a little bit. Yeah, this video was from my very first stream ever, ever. And you can see very scuffed Twitch chat on the right hand side. You can see everybody is the same color, not like the beautiful diversity we have now and it was among us with a group of my tiktok friends it's not the greatest of videos it's not the video i am most proud of but uh i think as as a video a standalone video of my very first twitch stream not bad not not too bad not too shabby self-proclaimed artist reacts to fan art If you didn't catch that intro because I made the volume way, way, way too quiet, it's- I said, uh, Hello, my name is Anthony Chen. What did I say? And I am a professional amateur artist. And I am a professional amateur artist. Yeah, can you guys tell like the sort of aesthetic I was going for? I was really going for like the uh, the tortured, uh, tortured artist who's too mysterious to be understood by anyone and you know, stands out as societal boundaries uh, as a lone wolf, sigma male, giga chat type of thing. You know, you know, you know what I'm talking about? Genshin Impact. And then I discovered the game called Genshin Impact. One year ago, right here, on April 17th, 2021. Actually, let's see. Oh, almost a year or two. The It's like one year and one year and two weeks ago, this video was uploaded and it is titled How Not to Roll for Venti. Oh my God. Can you already see? I look so young in this video compared to how I look right now. I don't even know what it is. Is it like the hair? My very first Genshin Impact video. Do I really want to watch this? I guess I could. I guess I could. Play just the beginning for you. Just so you can understand, like, compared to how my streams are now, you can see just how different they used to be. Fair warning, I said this at the beginning as well, but if you cannot handle cringe, I suggest you avert your eyes and look away now, okay? Don't say I didn't warn you. Hey everyone, Anthony here. Just wanted to say that all of these clips are taken- Oh god, I can't even stream, listen to this, oh my. Too. It helps me out a lot. Enjoy the video. If you're wondering, no, it's not even like, I didn't change my mic or anything. That's literally just because of the way like I talked in that room. Like I bet I could still sound like that right now. Hey everyone, Anthony here. Just wanted to say that all of these clips are taken straight from my Twitch channel and I stream every Friday and Saturday at twitch.tv forward slash Anthony Chen. Something, 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 something. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Literally. <laughs> How do I get a Genesis crystal? <laughs> wow. 
Oh. I didn't know what a Genesis crystal was. Okay, you gotta keep in mind, this is like, I, I barely played this game, okay? I, this was, this was the beginning. You are watching Evolution at its finest. Hi, how are ya? Dude, what is this? I do 11 damage to this guy, dude. Dude, I do two damage. Oh my God. <laughs> okay. <laughs> I have no idea who you all are. Please help me. Hello. Okay, let's go, let's go. Yes, fight him. Wee. Charge, <laughs> you go too, come on. Oh yeah. my yeah, God. Yeah, let's go guys, teamwork. Let's go guys, go team. Oh, you guys are killing me right now. Are we swirling cryo on the lower trail? <laughs> Wait, <laughs> what? This still doesn't make sense to me. All right, you guys ready for this? You gotta manifest venti right here. Manifest venti. Come on. <sighs> that ain't me. That on the screen right there. That's not me. That is an imposter. That is my twin brother, Andy, actually. Oh my god, no way. I started wailing here. No shot. Okay, okay. I, I didn't wail. I didn't wail. That was like $5 pack or something. Okay, 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 okay. Literally played this game for like two weeks and already busting out the credit card to roll for a venti who I really don't even know. Wow. There were signs. There were red flags. Good thing red's my favorite color. As you can see, I am very, very, very engaged uh, in this pull here. Now you might think to yourself, wait, that's a little weird. Didn't he just see like the wish? Not turn gold? <laughs> yep. I, who had just dropped money in the game, didn't even know that if you got a five star, the wish would turn gold yet. I, I guess that means like I, I got more than I paid for, right? Because every single pull was like a thrilling experience. Like I could get, I could get a five star, even though like the screen is clearly purple. And we know now like this is not a five star, but the early days of Genshin Impact. Oh my God. Absolutely clueless, dude. It's not gonna be Venti! Oh my god! Is this even allowed? Are they allowed to give like three star weapons? I'm paying like three dollars for each pull and you're giving me a three star weapon. This is literally a scam. Do you ever look at someone and wonder what is going on inside their head? If I get one more of these swords? <laughs> All right, I think you, I think you get the point there. I think you, spoiler alert. Sorry if you haven't watched that video yet and you were planning on finishing it, but did not get a five star that entire video. And then Venti's banner disappeared and that was the end of the story. And it has 207,000 views right now, which is why, I, th that's my question, why? Please don't watch that. Please watch some of my more recent content. For example, uh, the video I just posted, how I became a world record holder, or like the video before that, uh, I bet 50 polls on this. Those are all amazing, amazing videos you can find on my YouTube channel. And yeah, I think from that point on, I did more of the anime stuff and then i think when i actually first start oh the infamous college cooking stream it has 450,000 views right now why why are almost half a million people just obsessed with me making a peanut butter and jelly sandwich in my dorm room Ooh, this is another big milestone i met deluke's biggest hater uh this video right here was the very first Genshin Impact video I ever edited myself. Thankfully, I did learn how to play Genshin Impact a little bit more by the time this video aired, uh, but just the evolution of how far we've come. And then from there, I started just posting Genshin content and it has picked up pretty decently, I would say. Uh, it's worked out quite well quite well and with that although i did skip over like a section of nine months in between here because <laughs> i don't want this youtube video to be like an hour long because i do have to edit this tonight and get it out by tomorrow um, but that brings us to present day where we are sitting at 1 million subscribers it has been a crazy journey and there are several several people i do have to thank which I will in a specific video coming later this week. 
I just want to say thank you to you guys uh, in this video specifically for supporting my content, enjoying the stuff I put out and sticking with me through the whole way through, whether you be the first subscriber, which was me, or the 1 million subscriber. You guys mean the world to me. And I hope this recap was somewhat interesting for you to see just exactly how we've come uh, so far and the journey that we've managed to take on our way here. If you haven't already, please consider subscribing if you want to catch the 1 million special video coming out next week. Uh, I think that's not going to be something you want to miss. <laughs> it's, uh, it's definitely something you won't want to miss. And uh, if you want to join us live on Twitch, where you can watch the raw, unfiltered reactions, it's twitch.tv forward slash Anthony Chen. Once again, thank you guys so much for all your support. Appreciate you guys 100%. And as always, take care, have a wonderful rest of your day, and I will see you in the next video. Peace. <laughs>